Here's your 41 Now update, sponsored by Kansas City Regional Association of Realtors. Thanks for joining us, everyone. I'm Rhiannon Alley, and these are your headlines. A co-founder of a Christian school faces sex crimes against children. Dennis Creason was in court today. Prosecutors say the alleged incidents happened on school property at Oak Lawn Christian School between January of 2015 to all the way up to this month. Investigators say there could be more victims out there, so they have set up a hotline. After dozens of complaints over high utility bills this summer, KCPNL is now offering new payment options. The company will not disconnect your power if your bill is late through September. You can also sign up for a four-month payment plan for your current balance. KCPNL says you can call customer service for more information after the Labor Day weekend. Thieves targeting students' cars for one particular part. Yesterday, thieves stole three catalytic converters from cars parked at Liberty High School. Get this, the Hickman Mills School District says it's had 13 stolen in two months. Liberty says it's reviewing surveillance video and also increasing security. Your forecast is next. Did you know not all real estate agents are the same? Look for the Realtor logo to be certain you have a qualified advocate on your side. Visit KCRAR.com for more information. Friday night in the Big Town, 92 Saturday, 88 degrees Sunday. 87 on Monday with an increasing chance of thunderstorms as we go through the holiday weekend and even better chances next week around Tuesday or Wednesday. So the heat, the humidity are here. The best pool day, Saturday. You can get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com. Have a great weekend. Kansas City, are you ready for a pigskin party? Every Monday, we're tackling every game in our new podcast. Plus, stay in the know with your hometown team. Sign up for our weekly newsletter. And when you do, you can win $200 to buy tickets to a game. Go! Go! Just head to KSHB.com slash Chiefs and sign up today.